Hi guys, thank you so much for watching my video. Um, and in this video, I just want to kind of talk about um, how I've been feeling for the past uh, um, 24 hours or so, um, I guess, energy updates. And um, it began um, last night when I was uh, trying to go to sleep. Um, I was just sitting in bed speaking with my husband and I was just overcome with um, kind of a, a shakiness and an energy that um, just kind of took over my upper body um and i couldn't get rest because the energy was just radiating through me um so i really only slept about two hours last night because i woke up and i did some writing and, and things like that um and got back in bed for a few hours um, i awoke to um not to the pain immediately upon waking up over my knee and um where your it band kind of sits um and i kind of like just rubbed it and instantly and it's not pain pain it's like a growing pain when we we're kids that's what i compare it to um exactly like the growing pain when we we're kids and we're growing um but it spread through my, my entire leg um and so i got up again because the energy was intense and it began to move again throughout my entire body um, and this energy is giving me energy and so my understanding of it is like um i guess prior to understanding what is truly taking place within ourselves like when we are having um knee pains um ankle pains wrist pained um shoulder pains um certain areas of the body that is where we have these um vortexes of energy buildup um and it needs to be released but when we are in the beginning stages or in our unknowing in our sleep stages of this i think we take it on well i know because that's what i did we take it on as pain and burden and become a victim instead of when we finally wake up to in our awareness and what is taking place when we understand that it is blockages and um energy that is just there that has not been moved because there is a restriction um so i am at i don't know what stage of this i know that's never ending it it is always you know going to continue on as long as i live um but i am at the time of receiving i am at the time of regenerating and this regeneration heals at a cellular level um every time we receive more light it just has to be moved still so much like for myself i've noticed so much comes in at one time um and sometimes it comes in as way too much energy that i can stay up all night long for days and then sometimes it comes in and i'm just crashing um and i'm confused because both times and this might happen to me tomorrow or the next day um your body has to learn to deal with it. Um, and also I wanted to mention that, you know, I've had to do my own research and in the beginning of this research stage, a lot of what I was reading terrified me because we're programmed to be fear-based instead of seeing things with love and with hope. Um, and that's what I had to retrain myself to do. Am I really afraid or am I, have I been programmed to be afraid? Is it, am I really afraid of this or what I'm doing? Or am I afraid of what others are going to think because of what I am doing? Um, and that's questions that you'll have to ask yourself when you are doing this yourself, um, researching and whatever it is. But there is an energy 
that I understand it comes from um, our lower spine and we all know that we have spinal fluid so it makes kind of sense that there's energy that needs to be released um, and that energy has the capability of healing and giving us so much capabilities and in the beginning again because it wasn't really happening to me and it's called the kundalini if i'm correct or the shakti if i'm correct in saying all of this um i just call it energy i don't know um i hate putting labels i dislike putting labels on things because you know that's where judgment comes in it's just energy that is moving through your entire being and allowing you to heal and be your best self and give you complete understanding and it is never ending once it's released it is always going to be released and always moving and doing its job throughout you from what I think I understand um, but I'm certain that this has been taking place or trying to take place for a long long time and when we are not really in tune with what is happening with our own bodies we don't feel it or we feel it as um, illness um, and so now I can feel every single area I can feel where it's moving like a warmth like um, you know waves of just energy and um, movement that is just going through sometimes it stays in my legs for a long long time before it gets to my lower back um, and then up my midsection and even on the inside of my stomach in my heart and everywhere there I feel it it's moving all around in there trying to heal me and every time that it moves throughout there these areas um, especially where we have unresolved emotions it's releasing those unresolved emotions it has to resurface again in order for you to send it on its way which means you're going to feel it um, which means you're going to have to deal with it um, it might manifest and you might become angry or sad whatever it is because it's a sadness and a burden that we've taken on from our lifetime and possibly from our very first existence um, or our ancestors we retain all of that within our own DNA so I have been feeling it and um, <clears throat> today's a good day because it's just full of energy and again tomorrow I might crash I don't know but in on top of all of this, um, with the energy just radiating through me, there's a lot of movement going around um, around me as well, um, especially when I'm focusing on certain thoughts. Um, there's a lot, a lot of positive um, movement in flashes, and now I'm seeing different colors um, arriving in my environment too. And that is also telling me that I am progressing positively. I'm going in the right direction and um, it's great news so um, I just wanted to share that because I want you to have you know great hope for your own purpose and your own journey thank you so much this is Christy much love health and healing your way I am bringing purpose to your life take care